Hello, Pisces. It's my lady, and this it up. Oh, it was upside down. I don't know what just happened, y'all. We're just going to leave it like that. Um, it's my lady, and this is my lady's way tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly express. Oh, goodness. Is that upside down? All right, that's upside down, so we're going to keep it like that. All right, so this is upside down. So weekly express weekend reading. For the week of June 16th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are Tarot de la Nuit by Alexander Bach. No, yeah. And Carol Ann Eschenazi. Let me make sure. Yep. Alexandria Park and Carol Ann Eschenazi. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings, commenting, and hitting that notification bell. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, so we ain't going to cut the cards or anything because all the cards are already out here. I'm just trying to see how we're going to set this up. Because I still got to pull one card. I think all this is like some sideline or a different um, reading. Okay. Yeah, that's for something else. All right. So, we got the Six of Pentacles reverse. Mm. All right. At the bottom of the deck. Hold on. It's making me do it anyway. Very strong energy here, okay? Very. I mean, as you can see, everything was going bonkers. Uh, so we got the Ten of Cups here. So I do feel like somebody's falling out with family, friends, loved ones, partners, okay? Um, it's crazy, too, because I like feel somebody grabbing. I feel like I'm, I'm losing something. Something or someone is drifting away, but I feel like I'm trying to stop them from going, okay? That's what I'm seeing. All right, so we got this Nine of Swords here. So I do feel like there's a lot of anxiety um, connected to the whole situation, okay? A lot of anxiety, lack of sleep. When I do sleep, I wake up in, in sweats or, or panic because of night <laughs> nightmares. Okay, they're fighting. All right, so we got the Seven of Cups reversed here. So I do feel like somebody had to make a choice. I feel like I'm not happy with this choice, but I feel like I had to do it, okay? So this makes me feel like that leaving part. Somebody felt like they had to leave a situation because it's not good for them, okay? So we got the Empress card here. So new start, new beginning, new adventure. So I do feel like somebody is getting ready to have um, a lot of new and exciting and adventurous and, and caring and loving and, you know, just fulfilling things going on with their life after they leave this situation but it's like i didn't want to go all right and then we got the queen of pentacles here so with this queen of pentacles of course i do feel like somebody is getting ready to have more money to store and help people and do things for people with um and i also feel like um a better quality of life, okay? I feel like I'm comfortable. I'm going to be able to help people, do stuff for people. And I feel like somebody's leaving a situation where um, people felt obligated. Like, I mean, I felt obligated to help these people. These people just felt like I had to help them. I feel like that is cut off and I'm going to somewhere where um, I'm helping because I want to and it's appreciated and it's not um, expected, Okay. So let's see what's going on over here. All right. So we got this six of pentacles reversed here. So this is a previous situation I'm feeling like. So I do feel like somebody was putting more in. Um, this could be current for uh, some of you guys too. That could be uh, what's getting ready to happen in the future. Okay. And this is some of our future over here. Okay. But we got this six of pentacles here. Reverse. That means I'm putting a lot of time, a lot of effort, a lot of money into something or someone, and I'm not getting anything in return, okay? I feel like I'm being cheated. All right. So we got the full card here. So starting over. New starts, new beginnings. It's like, here I go again on my own. I don't care. Oh, goodness. Hey, hey. Everybody about to get put out. Sorry. Um. So here I go again on my own. 
and I do feel like um, somebody just don't care what happened. They just going to go and whatever happens, happens, okay? I do feel like, um, I feel like lucky. I don't know, I don't know if that's a name or, or, or what's going on, but I feel like somebody is very lucky. And I feel like things just keep falling into place, okay? So it's just like, okay, I, I, I quit or, okay, I, I'm leaving. I, I'm not leaving with nothing but my car and my keys, okay? And I do feel like that's just the start of, of a, a new beginning where you get to build your foundation, okay? Build your foundation up. So it looked like to other people like it's all bad, but it's not that bad for you. you just like, I got to get the heck out of here. I don't care. All right? So we got the hangman here. So I do feel like somebody was waiting for something, but I feel like, of course, whew, somebody is getting tired of waiting. Tired of waiting, okay? Um, so it looked like somebody getting ready to start something new. Somebody tired of waiting, and I do feel like they just going to take off, okay? Ten of Wands, that's another tired of waiting cards. I feel like emotionally defeated. I don't want to deal with this. I don't want to do this anymore, okay? So, we have the Seven of Wands here. So, with this Seven of Wands, I feel like I'm fighting as me against the world, okay? And it sucks because I feel like I'm telling people that I feel like I want to leave. They not trying to let me leave. Um, and I also feel like... I just feel back against the wall. They only they only want me to stay so I can help them, okay? And then I don't like this ten of wands and this ten uh and this death card together because that sometimes most of the time, a lot of times uh mean actual death, okay? Um, but a lot of times it just means somebody's just very 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 done with a toxic situation, and um they're ready to get get it over with, and move on, okay? Um, other than that, it could be somebody facing some very emotional things. And I do feel like it's going to cause some internal um, problems, which may lead to some kind of transitioning. Okay. Um, so we got the, the death card here. So that's the transition. That's the ending. That's the uh, transformation. Okay. But that's just a stop to something and a, a start to something else. So definitely new beginnings with this um, full card. I, what we got? One, two, three. I thought we had four major arcanas over here. But still, this is going to be a, a life lesson for some of us. And um, definitely a new beginning. Uh, I do feel like more of I'm not about to waste my time and effort on things that aren't serving me kind of situation. But I do feel like in the future, everything is going to be better for you. I feel like this is a person that loves to help. And I feel like I'm going to be able to help and not feel like obligated to do that. So it looks like somebody's cutting off family and, and bringing friends in as family, okay? Or somebody may be getting new family members in um, and deleting some of the old ones, okay? But other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.